It's not just teachers. Florida has a critical bus driver shortage. In fact, this is a nationwide issue. And tonight, Westview's Gail Pascoe Brown takes us to a job fair in Osceola County where driving a bus could be right up your alley. The sign says it all. Osceola County Public Schools is desperately seeking bus drivers, 35 of them. Osvaldo Rivero, a retired truck driver who came to this job fair, hopes to fill one of the slots. I noticed that uh, they were shorthanded. And, uh, and I have the qualification. I've been retired for about seven years. Rivero used to be a school bus driver for the district, too. The long day you enjoy it and do the right thing, you're going to like it. Transportation officials say driving a school bus is a great opportunity for someone who is retired, semi-retired, or looking to supplement their income. Some drivers will wake up at 4.30 in the morning, be done by 9, and then they have from 9 to about... I'll say one, one thirty, two o'clock, so they have time to go do a doctor's appointment, go get your groceries, go home and take a nap if you need to. Osceola County transports nearly 29,000 students a day. Until more people are hired, routes without drivers are split up amongst current drivers. Or we're asking a driver to do their morning run, and then they'll double back to get more kids and bring them to school. If you are thinking about becoming a school bus driver for Osceola County Public Schools, the starting pay is $16.50 an hour, plus benefits, which include Include health care, retirement, and paid holidays. From my experience, it's wonderful. If you know how to do the job and follow the instruction, the kid, they are good. In Osceola County, Gail Pascal Brown, West 2 News. If you did not make it to today's job fair, you can always apply on the school district website. You can also go to the transportation or school transportation facility and apply during regular business hours.